And with us for the next 30 minutes, I'm joined by the Conservative MEP, David Campbell-Bannerman. He's supporting a vote to leave in the upcoming EU referendum in Britain. And by the Green MEP, Jean Lambert, who is supporting Remain. So let's take a look at one of the stories in more detail, whether Turkey is going to join the EU or not. And I would suggest to both of you that neither Remain nor Leave is totally accurate or honest uh, in, in this. Let me come to the Leave. Uh, it is true that it is official government policy that Turkey yeah. should join the EU at some stage, though the Prime Minister is trying to kick it into the long grass. Mm. But even if the government was putting all its effort behind Turkey to join, it's a long way off. Well, it's been a long way off for some time. Exactly. Andrew, that's true. However, it is the aspiration to have Turkey, and we are, we are spending 1.8 billion on pre-accession funding. That's over the all the five uh, countries, including Turkey. Yes, that's yeah. right. It's, it's part of that package. The but there, I think there's a poster that says it could join by 2020. We know that's not true. Uh, I haven't seen that one on 2020. I think that is is not correct. Um, but I think it is. You know, the, the accession mm. process has been uh, restarted right. and speeding up. So that's fair enough that you're not saying it, it, it's imminent. Uh, and on your side of of the uh, argument, um, it isn't going to happen uh, soon. But it is policy that Turkey should join at some stage. And this referendum is not for tomorrow or the next day. It's for a long while. So it's fair to raise that, is it not? I think it's fair to raise that if you're actually talking about future enlargement of the European Union, not if you're using it as a shorthand for something else. And it's true that you know, if Turkey were to join, there's a long process to go through, and certainly the current government, many of us consider, is going backwards in a way you know, that it's not going to meet the criteria. But yes, it's still on you, the by agenda. By the current government, you mean the current Turkish it's government? The current Turkish government, Because of yes, the move that, to a more Islamic um, well, form government. Well, a more government. repressive government. Yeah. It's not necessarily Islamic. It's the fact that it's well, repressive sorry, and is, that, you know, Islamic. it's... Yes. But it's also the fact, as you just mentioned, about what's happening That's to the immunity of people rep from the sort of okay. more left-wing Kurdish party. So it's, yes, it's on the table at some point. I mean, yeah. I'm assuming that you know, given what the government here has proposed in terms of future referenda, that would be a treaty change. And yes. so it becomes okay. a decision. But it's right. okay. still on the table. Well, on that reasonable degree uh, <laughs> of, 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 of agreement there. <laughs>